ladies and gentlemen, medicine and public health have the purpose to improve health of the people. But the problem is that so far nobody knew what health truly is. There are many theories but nobody can tell exactly. Now we have a new definition of health and this is the micro model and you know when you go in here then you should understand health much better. You see all living creatures need health and in order to be healthy they need to fulfill the demands of life and for these purposes they have resources and what are these demands of life? Here you see just a few examples, nutrition, protection against threats from the nature, cold and other threats, and social integration. Now in man this is somewhat more complicated, particularly the resources, we have two types of resources. We have the biologically given potential and we have the personally acquired potential. We speak of potentials because <coughs> we need our resources now but we also need them in the near and in the far future. And future resources must be called potential. Now the biologically given potential that is what you have received at birth. The personally acquired potential are those that you have actually developed yourself on the basis of this biological given, potent uh, given potential. And with these potentials you must now fulfill the demands of life. And you see the situation has become already more complicated there are now three arrows for complex interactions that are occurring here. Now you see the next point is that the person of higher potential is a place where you have to assume person, personal responsibility for health. Everybody is responsible for his health. But the point is, around the individual there is the society with the so-called social determinants of health. And the society also must assume responsibility for health. And you can see it here with the three double arrows. And if you look at that picture, you immediately recognize that the factors that determine health have become already much more complicated. 